In our side, the accountant and our British Prime Minister Lee Struess says that she will not cut public spending after her government came under pressure to fund vast tax cuts that have roid markets and sparked alarm over government finances. The Institute of Fiscal Studies, IFS, said this week that the government needed to find £62 billion of spending cuts or tax rises to stop the public debt growing. Natrus was asked at her weekly parliamentary questions if she was still committed to a pledge she made during the Conservative Party leadership contest that she was not planning public spending cuts. trillion pounds of public spending. We were spending 700 billion back in 2010. What we will make sure is that over the medium term the debt is falling. But we will do that not by cutting public spending but by making sure we spend public money well. And the honourable gentleman talks about our spending which he doesn't seem to support on the energy price guarantee. But the reality is he can't criticise us on one hand for spending money, on the other hand claiming we're cutting public expenditure. Yes, I very much agree with the Honourable Gentleman. We need to deliver for the people of Northern Ireland. That means making sure that we have free-flowing trade east-west as well as north-south. It means making sure that the people of Northern Ireland can benefit from the same tax benefits as people in Great Britain. And it means resolving the issues over governance and regulation. Now, I would prefer to achieve that through a negotiated solution with the EU. But if we're not able to do that, we can't allow the situation to drift. We have to proceed with the Northern Ireland.